What's up, Pokemon trainers? It's Oshniap here, and today I'm going to be playing Pokemon Showdown. And uh, Pokemon Showdown is like an online Pokemon game where you can battle, only battle, not like the adventure mode and stuff like that. It's pretty cool. I've been playing it for about a month now, and I decided I might as well show it to everyone else who doesn't know that, that it's out there. So I'll be playing random battles. Random battles are when you just choose a random, they, it gives you like random set of Pokemon, random six Pokemon. You can get lucky sometimes by getting like legendaries, I guess, or sometimes you just get like first stage Pokemon. But uh, yeah, it's pretty cool actually. I usually get like okay, like I, I won't complain. My team right now was pretty, pretty normal. Uh, I liked it, so yeah, enjoy. So I'm gonna start off with a Fancy, a level 95 Fancy against an Abra. And uh, Abra goes for Psychic. That's surprisingly. I, I get surprised because I thought like the Abra would be slower. So instead of my Stealth Rocks, as usual, uses Calm Mind and it powers up. I use a knockoff. Not that much damage, but I knocked off its item. That's a good thing. Thing out of like a, a skill band. I mean a choice specs. It knocks out my Fancy. That's not good. So I throw out my Pachirisu. The Pachirisu has a balloon, but um, that, it doesn't matter because it doesn't know any ground type moves. My opponent. So I use Thunderwood to slow it down as I see that it's going really fast and it might go on a sweep. I use Super Fang, leaves it to yellow, and uh, it takes me out with like that's a tough Abra. It took out two more Pokemon already. I go for the like, Galvantula because I realize I should just knock it out. I didn't throw it out, I switched it out at the beginning because I thought I could use it later on, but as I see that I lost two Pokemon already, I decided to throw it out and use a Bug Buzz. I use Volt Switch because uh, I don't know. I don't really know why I use Volt Switch there. I didn't really have anything good against um, the skull except like that. Um, except uh, what's it called? Sucker Punch. But uh, unfortunately, I was being stupid there because Sucker Punch only works on Pokemon that are faster than you. He goes for the Willow Wisp, but I have the the my self secure thing. I'm sorry. And but uh, he does it again and it goes away again. Like, he has a leftovers apparently. I, I go for the Geiger Drain just to get some energy, leaving him at red. But well, here's the trick. He goes for a paint split. That is not good for me. So we're both back at green and he's taking the advantage of this. I go for an Aqua Tail. We're both going basically offensive right now because you know there's there's no really point in switching out. He restores health with, with leftovers again. I go for the Geiger Drain and I think he should be knocked out in the next few moves. He goes for a substitute, but he's too weak to make the substitute. We go for the Giga Drain. He is at red right now. He's about to get knocked out. Goes for a pain split. And again, this this process is just taking so long. It's probably the longest battle in this whole battle. Go for the flamethrower, trying to take him out. Going offensive. Goes for the ice beam. We're both down at red. And I use, believe, Giga Drain. Yes, that, that's Giga Drain. And he's out. So his next Pokemon is going to be a Uxie, and I'm thinking that he'd be like an offensive type, so I just keep on attacking him like this. He seems to be an offensive type, but I, and he is. He goes for Psychic, knocking out my third Pokemon. I go for the Galvantula. He hasn't switched out any Pokemon till now, tricking me. He has a Kabalion, a legendary, you know, Kabalion. I go for the Bug Buzz. It, it definitely resists because it's a Steel type, obviously. And I go, go, I go for the Volt Switch. It does a lot of damage. Oh, well, a certain amount of damage. But decent damage. I go for elect my electric that I had. It goes for the stealth rocks. Now we both have stealth rocks on our team. And he's taken out three of my Pokemon so far. He goes for the Thunder Wave. That's slowing me down. Doesn't really matter. Because um, electric is basically a slow Pokemon. But I, I do have the possibility of not hitting moves. He goes for the close combat. His stats are lowered, of course. And I go for the wild charge. I do have the life orb. That's why I did a lot of damage. He has leftovers apparently, and he goes for the close combat again, knocking my Electric out. That's my fourth Pokemon out. I only have two left, he has four. That is not good for me. So he's restoring with some um, leftovers again. And I go for the Galvantula, going for the Volt Switch, I believe, because all my other moves are like Bug Buzz and like moves that won't even do anything to him. So I just go for the Volt Switch. My Lotic is sent out, and yeah, this one has the leftovers, I believe. Yuxi's. He throws his Yuxi back out. Showing that it has no, doesn't really have, I don't have anything good against it, except my, um, Galvantula. So I go for the Dragon Tail, and his Vespaquin gets sent out. 
He restored and he has a lot of his leftovers. I use toxic. He uses toxic. That is hilarious. So yeah, we both use toxic at the same time. And I don't really want to fight this Vesper Queen right now because it's pretty. It looks Vesper Queens get really tough when they start using their stat moves. So I send it back out. Oh, and by the way, Dragon Tail was only my only attack move that that could possibly hit them. So yeah, they use toxic on Swablu. I don't know why. I just thought I could land a little bit more damage with that toxic. He has the leftovers as well, but you know. Toxic is taking it down pretty well. I use Res. This is my little came with a Chestal Berry. That's really handy. So yeah. And he goes for the return. Does a lot of damage actually. I thought they wouldn't do that much. Since my little ticks are usually bulky. But not in this case of course. I use go for the Hidden Power. The Hidden Power was Grass. So that was my choice. Grass type move or Dragon type move. So I had to go for the Dragon Tail. Okay. He uses return. Leaving me a little mid amount of HP. Go for the dragon tail just to send it out. Goes back to the Uxie. That stealth rock has helped me a lot. Psychic and I'm out. So my last Pokemon is Galvantula, and Galvantula is at a certain amount of HP. He's at almost the green. I use Giga Drain to get more energy, and I do. That works out pretty good. He sends back his Vespa Queen out, I guess thinking he could use a flying type move on me. But something I use Bolt Switch. Vespa Queen is also a flying type, so that's super effective on him. One Pokemon left, Swablu. I was fortunately going to go for the Bolt Switch because that's super effective. And that's the battle. I win. Uh, thank you for watching. And uh, yeah, um, my opponent was Butter My Nutter. If you want to go to PokemonShowdown.com, go ahead. I recommend it. It's a lot of fun. I found it uh, on Google, I think. I was just typing, I don't know, random stuff. So yeah, uh, if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to hit like, subscribe for more. Pokemon Showdown videos or Pokemon videos and uh, yeah, see you guys next time. Oh and guys, uh, sorry for all the stuttering in the video. Yeah, it's my first time, you know, people on the first time get all worried and stuff. Cause this is their first, cause it, get, get, get it first. I'm just, I'm just kidding, um, just sorry for the stuttering. I'll, I'll get better. I will. Just, just give me time to get more confidence and uh, yeah. So uh. Sorry for the stuttering, and uh, here's a picture of a Pokemon dog and a Pokemon cat. So yeah, you're welcome. Bye. Bye.